What's happening, everybody? We are here at the play Spunk, and uh, I have a person that is here that's going to be witnessing the play. Tell us your name and where you're from. Uh, I'm Abdullah Pullen. I'm from Philadelphia, PA, and I go to school at the Community College of Philadelphia. Wonderful. Now, how did you hear about the play Spunk? Uh, from my acting teacher, Dr. Hall, she uh, introduced it to me at the end of the play we were doing this semester, uh, Much Ado About Nothing, and I realized that one of the actors in Much Ado About Nothing was is also in Spunk. So. Are you excited to watch this play, Spunk? Very. Tell me why. When you see someone you know on stage... <laughs> Might as well be excited. Can you tell everybody what you're studying at Community College of Philadelphia? I am an English major. I am uh, studying to do journalism, and I write for two platforms as of now. A platform called Live 24 Hours that's just getting started. Uh, We're focused on um, bringing attention to um, events and... uh, up-and-coming entrepreneurs around the city so if you need anything then talk to me Uh, and I also write for the student vanguard at CCP sounds like you're quite busy and I'm sure you had a great academic year are you all for the summer uh yes yes and the final question I want to ask you is um, what do you think of um, the professor that you know who you just mentioned what do you think of what she's doing and being uh, the director of, you know, plays and keeping it going here in Philadelphia. What what, what would you like to say positive uh, in reference to what you have observed from her uh, teaching and from what she is doing in the arts field? Um, She's a very great person, very humble. Uh, She can be a bit of a, excuse my language, hard ass at times, Uh, but... Uh, she always uh, powers through it and ends up at the end of the day producing a um, very great show. And that's what I learned from Stoop Days, what I learned from Much Ado About Nothing, and hopefully what I'll learn from Spunk. Again, tell everybody your name Abdullah Pullen. Congratulations, keep up the good work. We thank you for joining us right here. There's more to come. Stay right there. What's happening, everybody? Well, many people have been here to see Spunk, and we have a gentleman here that actually has uh, witnessed the uh, play Spunk. Tell us your name and where you're from. David Threadgill, Philadelphia. Yeah. And how did you hear about the play Spunk? My granddaughter, she brought me here tonight for a class project, I believe. Yeah, so I came and I enjoyed it. It was really nice. Uh, Zora Hurston is one of my favorite writers, so it was the spirit of the moment for me. She had to come. Uh, and I just got dressed and came on. And we're glad that you came. Yeah. Have you ever been to any of the previous plays that no, they have put on? No, but I will make another one. I didn't know this exist wow. until now. Yeah, really nice. Yeah, I recommend anybody come see it. Yeah. And we thank you for coming out, and we appreciate you enjoying Spunk. Tell everybody again your name. David Threadgill. Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay, right. we're getting more feedback. Well, we're here at the place Spunk, and we're getting some positive feedback. Um, I happened to meet this young lady some time ago at another event. Tell everybody your name. My name is Brene brown Holman. And where are you from? Jersey. Wonderful. We're glad that you came over to Philadelphia to witness Spunk. Now, have you um, been involved with any other plays before with the company that does this? No, I actually haven't. So this is your first time? Yes, it is. So let me ask you this. How did you hear about Spunk? Uh, Courtney Lynn is one of my good friends, so she invited me and I wanted to support. So can you tell us what you thought of Spunk? I absolutely loved it. I loved the di- Zora Neale Hurston is one of my favorites. So um, just seeing everything depicted the way that it was and hearing the dialect and seeing the costumes and the actors and actresses were just excellent. So it was, it was just like sitting in my bedroom watching a movie. <laughs> Wonderful. So again, tell everybody your name and encourage people to support the arts that they're doing. Look into that camera and encourage them. Well, hello, hello. You definitely need to come support this program. Spunk was excellent. You will absolutely love it. And if you have not come to see um, Kaleidoscope, (laughs) you're missing out, so you need to come. Once again, and tell everybody your lovely name. Brene Brown-Holman. And we're checking in from Spunk.
Spunk, there's more to come. We are here at Spunk where people are sharing feedback from this amazing play. Tell us your name and where you're from. Diana Reed from West Philadelphia. Uh, sister friend to Rhonda Rise who was in the play. It was fabulous. Just the music, the performance, the vocals, everything was on point. Just I'm excited to just be here and to join this um, wonderful performance. I, I'm just excited that I got an opportunity to be here today. Wonderful. Now, have you ever been at one of the previous plays uh, that they ever had? I have not. This is my first time. And you will come back and support? Absolutely, I will come back. I'm here with my daughter and my sister tonight, and we will absolutely attend many more performances here. This was amazing. Absolutely. So look into that camera and encourage people who have not witnessed uh, the plays from Arden Blair Enterprises Kaleidoscope. Encourage them to support the arts of what they're doing. Please do come out and support Art and Blair Enterprises. Uh, tonight was amazing. You will enjoy it. You'll get an opportunity to just go back in history, um, especially from um, African American culture. So just please come out, support. It was wonderful. You enjoyed this experience. Great. And tell everybody again your name. Diana Reed, West Philadelphia, and I actually have a program, Our Mom's House, which focuses on performance arts and those um, girls who have lost their mothers. Wonderful. Stay tuned for more. We're broadcasting from the play Spunk. We are here live from the play Spunk, and we have another person who witnessed this wonderful play. Tell us your name, where you're from. I know you're a little hot. Yeah. But you'll be okay. And it was wonderful. It was well worth, well worth it. Um, hi, name? my name is Theta Parker, and I am. I was invited. Uh, my sister and I came. We actually, I actually loved it. Um, the music was wonderful. The vocals were amazing. Um, just to be kind of transported back to a different time, a different mindset, um, to look where where we've come and how far we still have to go. It was really a wonderful experience. Now, have you ever been to a Kaleidoscope uh, play before? No, this was actually my first one, will not be my last. Um, this kind of set the tone for what I'm expecting. Um, the performance were, was, was really great. I really love the guitar, just the kind of bluesy, um, the, you, you know, just kind of transported me back just to outside of walking outside of the doors of the hustle and bustle to a different atmosphere. And you know what was really interesting as I was watching, and I've been at several of their plays, um, it, it seemed like everybody had a key role. It yeah, wasn't like yeah. one person or two people. Everyone was involved. Absolutely. Um, the actors outperformed the stage. So this in this arena, I expect that it will get larger. Their, their, their abilities will transcend where they, where, are, where they are now. Um, the performances were wonderful. We thank you for sharing. Once again, tell everybody your name. Hi, I'm Theta Parker, and I'm just glad to be here. Wonderful. Thank, Enjoy you. thank you. Okay, we're checking in live from Spunk, getting feedback from the play. There's more to come. Well, we're definitely here at Spunk, and people are sharing their feedback from the play. Uh, tell us your name and where you're from, and we're delighted to have you. Sure. Uh, my name is Autumn Sellers. Um, I am from here in Philadelphia. I went to school right here at Temple, and I just graduated. Well, congratulations. Heads up. What did you get your degree in? Uh, I actually got my doctorate in anthropology. Wow. Yeah. Doctor. Yes. Doctor, I love it. Congratulations for you for the class of 2018. How did you hear about Spunk? So I actually heard about Spunk because Ali, uh, I know Ali who's the guitar man, um, but I also had heard of it before because of Zora Neale Hurston, and Zora Neale Hurston is one of the first black American anthropologists, so I'm an anthropologist, so I felt a connection. Oh yeah, definitely a connection. Um, so what was your feedback from looking at uh, the play today and witnessing what was going on with everyone? So, to be honest, like, I haven't been to a lot of theater productions, and I really loved the music. I loved how personal it felt. You know, I think I've been to, you know, when I was a kid, I went to some, like, you know, you go to theater and stuff when you're a kid. And so, it's usually, like, you know, play is way up there, but this was really close and intimate, and, like, you could just... I was just so impressed by the actors and the music and just I'm just thinking about how much it took for like what two hours to be projecting out into the audience like that so I thought it was fantastic it was beautiful it was inspiring so 
So we thank you for coming. And, and what can you say to people that are, are watching us now to encourage them to support Kaleidoscope Art and Blair Enterprises? So I think theater and a lot of the arts are underappreciated and they are so crucial for us to live, not just live, but thrive as a society. So I think supporting the arts, especially in your local community, is crucial for us to stay, stay vibrant and alive and happy with each other. So um, I'd say, you know, especially Art and Blair and African American theater, I think it's really crucial for people to keep supporting this. And it's what makes our city vibrant. So. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. And tell everybody your name again and give the doctor in the front because you worked hard for that lady and congratulations. Sure. Thank you so much. My name's, this is weird, but okay. It's Dr. Autumn Sellers Leon um, from Temple University. Thank you so much for sharing. Continue success in what you do. Thank you so All right. Much. Appreciate My pleasure. Simone? Absolutely. Simone Malone. Thank you. Well, again, folks, you heard some feedback from people uh, that were here at the play uh, Spunk. Make sure you support Art and Blair Enterprises, Kaleidoscope Cultural Arts Collective. There's going to be more happening uh, down the road. Uh, they just wrapped up this particular uh, season in time, but you can definitely follow them on Facebook and Instagram as well. Uh, it's going to be really, really outstanding information through Art and Blair Enterprises, uh, Kaleidoscope Cultural Arts Collective. I'm Simone Malone, and we are live at Spunk in Philadelphia.